And the next stage is Construction Yard. Now you may notice, wait a minute, this wasn't in the movie. You're right, it wasn't. And we get to see what Woody's been doing. Meanwhile, Woody is trapped inside Al's penthouse apartment. He is greeted by three other western toys, Jesse, a rootin' tootin' cowgirl, Bullseye, Woody's faithful horse, and a wise old prospector still in his box. And with Buzz, all of them are just, just traveling. Traveling to Al's, toys, to Al's Toy Barn by foot, which is great. Now, one of the missions is that you have to rescue some little tykes. I thought that was the name of the company, not the actual people. Uh, whatever. I guess the, it's the equivalent of calling Lego bricks Legos, but uh, whatever. It's not that important. What is important is that there is another Pizza Planet token over here. Along with a little tyke person. Okay, so what this puzzle involves is um, getting this paint bucket and mixing colors of paint. Apparently on the internet I've heard that this was how a lot of people learned to mix colors, which is pretty funny. I mean, I learned mixing colors before playing this game. You know, back in kindergarten, I had this journal where I just draw in it, draw a bunch of weird fever dream stuff. And, um... And I had crayons with me, and I would always use the crayons to uh, mix colors. That's what I used to always do. So yeah, mixing colors, learning about it kind of helped me with this puzzle. It wasn't how I learned it. Ah, dang, have it. Yeah, I know. Right. Wait, what am I doing? Sorry, I forgot that I had the green I had the green lasers, so I just kinda wasted a whole bunch of it. It's fine though. I'm sure they respawn anyway. One bad thing about the green lasers is that you can't really aim with it. It doesn't have an auto aim like the normal laser, so you just kinda have to get in place. What does Mr. Potato have have to say? Oh no, he's missing his eye! Hey Buzz, you need a disc launcher to defeat the angry jackhammer, which is the uh, mini-boss of this level. Oh, boss, yeah. If you find my missing eye, I'll give you the disc launcher! Alright. Deal. Yeah, once again, this music track right here that you might not hear, but I definitely hear it, and it is quite a bop. I mean, if you want, you can look it up yourself and listen to it, but yeah, it is great. Oh my god, shut up. Oh, that does it. Okay. Well, as soon as I actually get up there. I 
I think that building over there might be where Potato Head's eye is. Because it's not anywhere around here. So I guess I may as well go over here. Yeah, I'll be honest. I haven't played this I haven't played this in so long that I kind of forgot where the Mr. Potato Head parts are. But what I do remember is that Slinky's down here with the time challenge rather than um, RC. Hi, Buzz. If you could find five missing wrenches and bring them to me in time, I'll give you a Pizza Planet token. Heck, it might even be outside of the cement. Who knows? Or like the cemented area. Alright. And here's the other one. It's kind of blended in with the background. Well done, Buzz. You have found all the, the all the wrenches. Here's your piece of planet token. All right, thanks, Slink. Tykes, guys. Ah, oh, Ham was up there. Or, he still is, but I saw him up there. Huh? Ah, this is how you get up here. Okay, that makes sense. It's just ham up here. No eye for Mr. Potato Head. Oh, actually, now that I think about it, I think this, uh... I think this over here is for getting on the construction site, which would make sense. Since it has no other use. Alright. Uh, we have to pull this switch again. Not really pull it, but... You know what, you know what I mean. Just get on the tire. And hold on. There he is. There's one of the little tykes guys. Only one more left. I think pulling this lever does something. I think it gives you like a shortcut that brings you up here without having to use the uh... I forgot what you call it. Scooper? I don't know. It's not a forklift, that's for sure, because I'm pretty sure that would not lift things. Ooh, that was a close one. No!
Here we go. Uh, there we go. Now, where does this take us? Wait a minute. Do we have to. Oh, nope, never mind. Takes us up here. Thank, thank God this game's old and doesn't really have lighting effects. And so, like, the shadow is just a dot uh, below you. It's really useful for platforming games like this to have something like that because they can see exactly where you're, yeah, where you're gonna land if you're like jumping or something. There's these tools coming out. Well, this is gonna be fun. No! Ah! And all the way back at the bottom. Great. Just great. How do we even get back up? We pulled that lever, right? What does that even do? Wait a minute, isn't there like an elevator somewhere? From what I remember, I think there is. Yep, I was correct. Am I the only one who finds this music kind of relaxing? Like, could be my nostalgia for this game, but I don't know. Oh, I actually made it. Oh, and I got Mr. Potato Head's eye. That's great. That's great. There we go. Now the elevator reaches to up here. Wow. All right. Thank God that elevator exists. Cause now I actually have a, actually have the excuse to get off of that, of that site and then come towards Mr. Potato Head. Wow, thanks, Buzz. In return for finding my eye, I will let you use the Disc Launcher. It should help you defeat the toughest enemies. Alright, thanks. You don't, we only have ten of them. That's great. And only five more. So I'm able to... Oh, you can grab multiple. That's great. You can get up to twenty of them. Or can you? Oh, you can get 30 as well! Man, thanks, draw distance. This is great. Yeah, more of them. Oh, you can only hold up to 30. Okay. I had a feeling that'd be the case. Oh. Nice. Actually, I think they have more discs up above where the uh, boss fight is. So, I don't really have to worry. And there he is. It's the Jackhammer. Ha 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 ha. Defeat the Jackhammer boss to get a Pizza Planet token. I think I used to be terrified of this guy as a kid as well. I mean, he does look pretty scary, I will admit. No! Oh, what a save.
There we go. There we go. Uh, oh, there's some discs right there I can use. There we go. I think you have to be facing him at all times. Or, like, the camera has to be, not fuzz. There we go. There we go. And there it is. All right. Now I guess we could just search for more uh, coins. How many do we have? 47, so we just need three more. Ooh, that was a close one. Come on. Oh. Come on. Arr. Ah, screw it. There's no way I can get that anyway. There's one. All right, two more. Make that one more. Yeah, I'm definitely, you can tell I'm definitely trying to get rid of these. And make that no more. All we need now is the last, as the last uh, of the little tykes, which I forgot where it is. All right, one more. I'm sure it's up there, where the uh, yeah, this construction site. I'm sure that's where the final one is. I guarantee you that's where it is. Either that or behind it. Which could be the case. You never know. There we go. Enough of those discs. I don't really like the disc launcher, honestly. It's not that useful, in my opinion. And I prefer just normal laser shots. Ooh, there's a crane over there. At least I think that's a crane. Yeah, it should be. Might be on top of that. There he is! Come here, you little rascal. All right. Thanks for finding my little tykes, Buzz. Here is a Pizza Planet token. Thank you so much, sir. I don't know why exit level has a question mark after it, but not keep on playing. What's up with that?